Hey, what's going on guys? It's Marcus at IQ Computer Services. Today we're going to be updating the BIOS on an MSI motherboard. Z170A from MSI. All right, we're updating the BIOS. Start off, hit the delete button on your keyboard once you power on. That's going to bring you right in. Keep in mind, we already downloaded the latest BIOS. Check the link in the description for the BIOS that I used. From MSI, extracted it, and then copied those files to the root directory of a USB stick. All right, next thing we're gonna do is go down to mFlash. Click on that, mFlash, you see it's highlighted. Okay, it's saying, do you want to flash these BIOS? So we're gonna hit yes. We're in a flash mode. All right, and here's where the magic begins. System is gonna automatically reboot. And then on screen, you're gonna see the BIOS updater. See, it says enter flash mode. Now where we're gonna select the newest BIOS file, see here. It's saying, do you, are you sure you want to select this file? Yes. Okay, so at this point, the BIOS is updating. Make sure you do not power off your computer at this time. Make sure you don't lose power or hit any buttons. Just wait, sit back, give it a few minutes, and it's gonna run through. I'm gonna pause the video here and then come back once it completes for you. All right, so once it gets to 100%, it's gonna automatically reboot the system. And if you have your operating system installed, it's gonna go ahead and boot you back into your OS. If not, go ahead and hit delete again once the computer comes back on. And we're gonna check that BIOS version so you can see that the newest version that you just downloaded has been updated. All right, so we're in. And now we can look up here and see that BIOS version has been updated. So it was successful. If you got any questions, feel free to get in touch with me, iqcomputerservices.com, or find me on Facebook, IQ Computers. Uh, you might be curious, why would you want to update your BIOS? There's a few good reasons to do it. Uh, one of them includes uh, fixes that the manufacturer is going to come out with, uh, support for newer devices, uh, such as graphics cards, uh, SSDs, NVMe uh, storage, and also um, updates to like supported CPUs. Uh, so that's some good reasons to go ahead and update your BIOS. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, if it helped you out, please leave a like. Give us a comment down below. Have you ever updated your BIOS on your system? Have you had any problems? If you got questions, leave a comment down below.